Right, here's a wee video just to show my layout how I'm mocking up my plans for putting push button fiddle brakes onto my buggy. It's based on a Range Rover P38 parts from after 1999 when they had four wheel traction control. So it's an ABS modulator and a, a high pressure pump with an accumulator on it. Uh, and these were on the car configured with a Wabco Type D ECU. So I'm not using an ECU here, it's just the modulator and pump. Uh, the pump has a pressure switch on it, worked off a relay, and it's already pre-configured to operate at 170 bar or uh, 2500 uh, freedom units. So the modulator has 12 solenoids inside it, and I have a little set up here of 12 switches which are currently pre-configured to operate my front right wheel cylinder. Uh, my buggy has 16 inch drum brakes on it. Uh, I don't have discs so I do need a bit extra volume compared to most guys running buggies. So that's another reason to have this accumulator. It gives you a volume that you're just not getting from a regular master cylinder. So if I operate a single switch here now, you don't have to mess with all these 12 switches. It's purely for the layout to understand the configuration of the solenoids in the modulator. But if I operate a single switch and you watch the vice grips, the vice grips are just clamped onto a bit of channel. So when you see them move, that's the fuel cylinders. Just one fuel cylinder operating here is bending that bit of channel open. And you can hear the pump running, that's all the power it uses. So hopefully that gives some idea of what it is I'm trying to achieve. Cheers.